we are happy to be here because we are presenting not only the artists for the pavilion, where we have here what has been called, the person has been called by many names, <laughs> <laughs> the infantry of Philippine art. And uh, you know, he's a person who can predict the future of art because he makes the future Whoa. of art happen. <laughs> Well, a few years ago, we were in the Philippines, me and Adam and Kervis. We were in a little t uh, town called Panglao. It's an island. Anyway, there we had dreams on that island. David said in, in Bahol he'd never dreamt so strongly because David never remembers his dreams. So um, he really had a, a sort of a, a nocturnal resonance with uh, Bahol. There were two stingrays. And one of them said, oh, look, it's raining again. And one ran up on a tree and stayed there and remained there and then slowly evolved into what we call Ita. Then the other uh, stingray got driven, uh, carried by the, uh, by the tides, you know, and got as far as the middle of the Philippines called Aklan. And they create, that's another ethnic group called Ati Tikan, and they have a festival there called Ati Ati Astronomical, oral tradition, ceremony, knowledge, navigation, calendar, understanding, aboriginal. The landscape, Aboriginal, stories of the sun, moon, planets. I wanted to go back and trace back into somehow um, Filipino tradition, which he finds is, is being lost um, um, within modern Philippine culture. So he wants to go back and revisit through Dreamtime, um, a past of um, initiations and ceremonies and rituals, and he's doing it really through the old tradition. Astronomical tradition. Kualsa Nebula. Mythology. A mnemonic curtain putting his hand over a box and under it and around again. The dying new moon. Sunburst. There you have the two things that are interlinked, space and time. I was so inspired by the concept of relativity. And I love the idea that uh, things can only exist within the concept of uh, space and time. Remember, in the performance I did here, I do something that I kind of invented. That's time, point, and that's space. After that, you create a language of hands because that is also our way of communication.
experience and memory and hidden in the flower at my cleaver. Thank you. Our performances are not like some artists make up the performance in advance and it's one. No, it's a call it, we call it always a dialogue. Sometimes he tells me what he's going to do, mm -hmm. sometimes I don't, uh, he, uh, he doesn't, and the same with me. Mm -hmm. Sometimes I surprise him. Yeah, it's, you can be inspired by anything.